Well, if you're like me, you're wondering what to be transitioning to in terms of wardrobe for the coming fall season, but also trying to do so on a budget. I called in an expert and one of my oldest blogging friends, Kelly Snyder from Adore Your Wardrobe. Hey, Kelly. Hi, Sammy. How are you? It's just so good to see you. I can't believe we've been friends for 10 years. I've been <laughs> online for 10 years. When I say oldest, not that you're my oldest blogging friend, but we go back quite a way. Been blogging for a long time, and I've always appreciated you, Kelly, because you've always been so honest from almost day one. You were willing to, you know, go deep with me. And I love that you're doing the same for so many women now. You've pivoted your business in a way to demystify fashion and it's not an art but it's more math science what, I know, what is that all about i know crazy right so i mean i went through this in my you know after having kids and i was like yeah. my body in my you know 30s and 40s was not the same body i had in my 20s right like the 20s you feel like you can put on anything and it looks sure. fine and all your friends are in the same boat and as i like dove into what fashion is and kind of went to the roots of fashion i was like huh this is really math and science. This is like geometry. This is understanding proportions and balance and it's understanding the science of color and how the eye is attracted to certain colors. And, you know, and it, essentially it's like all of us, we fight against that so much because we, you know, it's, fashion is part and how we look is so much of a part of women. And it's not that we're vain. It's just, we're wired that way. Um, and so when we are frustrated, like when we see our best friend, right, wearing an outfit and then we're like, oh, well, I should try that. And then we do. And then we're like, oh, that did not look good. That did not look <laughs> right. We beat ourselves up. And what it's interesting is like, that has nothing to do with it. It's really about picking clothes that work with your body and not against it. And once you understand that, like it provides so much freedom um, because it becomes so much easier to pick out clothes. It saves you time. It saves you money. It saves you frustration. Um, and it's just, I, I want to be able to help women kind of demystify that whole piece because when we feel good, when women feel good, when we know that we look good, like there's really nothing that we can't accomplish. Really. Yeah, I'm so glad you say that because especially with quarantine and staying home, we've been looking at Pinterest, looking at social media. I mean, I feel like all my friends are like, look at this, buy this, this sale. And then it literally happened to me yesterday I just bought a friend adorable or bought a friend bought a dress that was I probably could buy a friend these days adorable on this friend and it was like a tent on me it was and I bought a size smaller and so I'm just like what is wrong and so you talk about dressing the right way it can literally shave 10 pounds off but what do you need to know to be able to do that you know, I, it's, it's understanding um, that there's balances that have to be created. Um, and that's the math and science piece. There's vertical balance and horizontal balance. And these are things that have never been, you know, you didn't go to home ec class and nobody taught you that. You can't go into Old Navy and someone's going to be like, well, that really puts you in horizontal balance or that puts you in vertical balance. Like that doesn't get taught. And so in Adore Your Wardrobe, we really dive into that so that you understand what balance looks like on your body. This is not a cookie cutter program. This is a program that really dives in how clothes look on you you and so that you understand what you need to do personally for your own fashion in order to create a wardrobe that you really adore, like what clothes you really need to pick. And there's also things people say, well, I don't, I don't like the style of this, you know, this influencer, or I don't like that. And like, we don't do that. Like, I'm not going to give you a, you know, 20 pieces of clothing that you can pick out and then origami them into 70 outfits. Like, that's not what we do. Um, I want you to build your clothes based on your lifestyle and based on your style. Like style is so intrinsic to people and it's, it's an outward expression of who we are. And I think women sometimes are scared of that because they're like, they don't necessarily see that, you know, in all of the social media, you know, what their personal style is. So, you know, it's, we call it the three legged stool, which is really, you know, picking clothes that work with your body, not against it, understanding what balance is and what fit means, and then picking them that are in your style. And when you have that trifecta, everything is amazing. Yeah, I so appreciate how you talk through the body types in a, in a different way, really, than I've heard them talked about before. And even on, on your social media, you give so many different examples of, if you're a carrot, here's a great example for you. Um, you have a free master class coming up that anyone can take. Can you tell us about that? Yeah, so on um, September 17th at 8 o'clock p.m., I will be doing a free masterclass on the Adore Your Wardrobe Facebook 
page called how to dress your body. Literally, that's what it's called. It can be any more simple than that, right? And I will go into the formulas that have built the Adore Your Wardrobe curriculum. So like you'll understand what I mean when I say horizontal balance and you'll understand what I mean when I say vertical balance. Like we dive into that. It's a free masterclass that anybody can take, but I really want women to really start thinking about fashion differently. Mm -hmm. Um, And I think once they start to think about it differently, they buy differently, they put their outfits together differently, and that's when the magic really happens. Agreed. Kelly, thank you so much for joining us. You can find more on adoreyourwardrobe.com. I hope you learn as much as I have. Kelly, thank you, and let's keep looking great. Thanks, Sammy. Have a good one. You too. Before I go, I need you to know, be someone you want to follow. The quarantine has given us unprecedented access to celebrities, at least through social media, which got me thinking, are you someone you'd want to follow? With an increasingly charged political and social climate, some have taken to social media to air whatever they think, whenever they think it. But if you had paparazzi following you around 24 seven, would you be proud of what they caught on camera? Colossians 317 tells us, let every detail in your lives, words, actions, whatever, be done in the name of Jesus, thanking God the Father every step of the way. C.S. Lewis also said it this way, integrity is doing the right thing even when no one is watching. So while we may not be celebrities, that doesn't mean someone isn't watching us or waiting for a word of encouragement from us. As you go through your day to day, ask God to reveal opportunities for you to both be an example to others and be more more aware of who you are when no one is around. I want to thank all my guests and sponsors who helped make this show what it is. And to each of you, have a great day. Make sure you make it great. And do not wait to tell someone you love how you feel about them. Bye, friends.